Il y a des enseignements chroniques qu'il peut avoir. Alors, il était question qu'on attende. On m'a hospitalisé encore pendant deux semaines. Il était question qu'on attende pour voir s'il faut opérer. The first half of the procedure starts with fixing a stereotactic frame to the patient's head. And during this time, we anesthetize the scalp and fix the frame. And then we do a CT scan and once the CT scan is done, the patient is got back to the theatre and we merge the pre-operative MRI images with the CT scan which gives us the coordinates of these nuclei which we are uh, trying to target. Uh, once the coordinates are obtained, then we uh, uh, put the patient on the operating table and we make two small holes or burr holes in the skull and put electrodes into the brain. As we are putting electrodes into the brain, we uh, study the firing of these neurons and based on the firing pattern of these neurons, we determine where exactly in the brain we are and uh, target the nuclei accordingly. Once we are in the desired target, we give small amounts of current to look at the patient to see uh, the beneficial effects the patient has and also the side effects which he may develop. So during this time, we keep constant, we uh, constantly keep assessing the uh, patient and uh, as we give current, we can see that the tremor which the patient has suddenly stops or their uh, rigidity becomes better and uh, their, uh, uh, their slowness of movements or bradykinase are improved significantly. And also we increase the current and look for side effects which the patients may develop. All these things will help us in programming the patient post-op in, uh, in our OPD. So once that procedure is done and once we put electrodes to both sides of the brain, then uh, we anesthetize the patient and we tunnel the electrodes and below the skin and connect it to a battery which we place in the chest. We uh, wait probably for a week to 10 days, allow the patient to get better and then uh, start uh, programming. Once uh, the patient uh, surgery is done and patient is fine, we discharge the patients in about a week to 10 days time and then the patient follows up with our movement disorder the, uh, neurologist on an OPD basis where we gradually program the patient. So we switch on the battery, gradually increase the current of the battery and gradually reduce the medicines. So we try to titrate the medicines and the uh, current thereby uh, to see which is the, uh, at what uh, dosage of medicine and at what current the patient has the maximal benefit. It was not an easy operation, but it was so successful. I want to take this appreciation to thank Dr. Shetty Satwiki and Dr. Majuna and the whole team. We had uh, anesthesias, we had those in rehabilitation, we had, they have been so good to us. Dr. Sheta and Dr. Majuna, they have been so patient, very kind, and they have been always on our case. Après l'opération maintenant aujourd'hui, je suis indépendant, je marche, je mange moi-même, je peux les suivre, donc je suis très devenu très indépendant, je peux vacter à toutes mes occupations.